here in the UK we have a real shortage of engineers. There's companies out there that are looking to fill engineering positions and they're finding all too often that they're having to go abroad to find the talented, uh, skilled staff to be these engineers. We really need to make sure that we have the skills that we need to grow the UK economy. That means having more engineers and in particular making sure we have more girls, more people from black and minority ethnic backgrounds taking up engineering, studying the subjects at school, doing maths and physics, deciding to take it on to university and then also importantly going on to work in engineering careers. And these can be incredibly varied and rewarding careers. It perhaps isn't what people would automatically think about uh, when they picture what engineering is. I got involved uh, with this project because we need more diversity in engineering. We need people from different backgrounds um, and we need people in different backgrounds to know that engineering is potentially a great career choice for them. Um, and to be able to be part of getting that message across and sharing my story as an engineer is an amazing opportunity. It is very, very important that we have a diverse workforce because that brings in all the ideas from different types of people with different types of experiences and values. Um, I was scared about going into engineering at first because I thought that, um, is it really something I could do? Do I think I could do it? I came because you hear quite a lot about how hard it is for women to get into engineering and I always found being told that it's hard was really off-putting. Um, and I came and it was really reassuring to, for people to talk about women in engineering being a normal thing rather than everyone being encouraging you because it's so rare and I thought it was really good that it was they were talking about how normal it was not how impressive it was to be an engineer engineering just how easy it is which I found really encouraging. The reason I came here was because I didn't really know uh, if especially now with the uh, credit crisis if, there were, if the uh, engineering market was sort of closing down a bit and uh, I discovered that really this it's, it's expanding and that this is really a good career path to choose. It's, it's sort of like going into the unknown with engineering because there's no subject. So when they explained, you know, you know there's a lot of diverse um, fields you can go into with an engineering and you travel and meet a lot, work with a lot of good people. So that was really appealing to me. I didn't really know what field to go into and that's, I was getting a bit worried about that because obviously I've got to apply for university soon. But actually speaking to a guy who's sitting next to me, he told me to just do what you're passionate about and then worry about like the titles and the, um, uh, the job titles and the different fields later because in the end uh, doing something that you're really interested in and passionate about is what's most important. Coming here today has shown me really that, that if, I put, if I put the work in, I think I could get to become an engineer and I could do what I want to do and I think I could be successful.